Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I thought I would film my fall slash autumn evening routine. To start off with I always make dinner first. This is around half five six ish because this is when Brady gets home so the first step to do is to make dinner. wondering I wanted to make us an easy simple spaghetti bolognese. Of course as per usual Brandy pretends to help, gives me a cuddle and then goes back into the front room and it just seems like he's done work but he hasn't done anything. So that's his, that's his part for cooking, but at least he's got to clean. I did make him do one job and that was to lay the table. So I made a cute little time lapse of him and he lit a candle, it was so cute. I didn't even realize until I edited this that I was like, oh my God, it's actually really sweet. I mean, seriously? So as I cooked, of course, it is time for Bradley to clean, <laughs> which makes me very happy because I've done the fun part and now I can go on the sofa and relax for a little bit, but I do put away the washing the next day. So yeah, I do leave that out, but then I just think, oh, I want to relax after I've eaten dinner. So that is my time to have my dessert at the moment. I'm having this amazing yogurt. I get it from Aldi um, and I also have it with grapes. It is so good. It's such a nice sweet treat. So yeah. And then after Bradley has done the washing up, we just have a little cuddle on the sofa, watch some telly before I go on to having a bath or a shower and take my makeup off. So now it is time to have some me time. I didn't need to wash my hair today, so I thought, oh, you know what? I want to have a bath. I feel like there's nothing better in the autumn winter than to have a bath. I feel like it's so relaxing and so soothing. So I've got my unicorn dust, my candles on, and I'm having a nice relaxing bath. I'm then going to brush my hair with this new eco brush I got sent. It's actually really good, I just thought I'd show you guys. It was really kindly gifted. And then it's now time to take my makeup off. I've been using this Bliss makeup remover and it's actually really good. It's like a makeup melt, so you put it on your skin dry, which as you can see, you look really crazy when you do it. But it just melts your makeup off, it's actually really good. So I take my makeup off, like the majority of it, before I have my bath. And then when I'm in my bath, my pores open and then I think it's perfect timing to cleanse your skin after your bath because your skin is obviously, your pores are open, your skin's really hot and I just think it's perfect. So I take the majority of my makeup off with the makeup now and then also my cellar water. Then I jump in the bath and then I cleanse it after. I always like to lay out my pyjamas before I jump into the bath, so as soon as I get out of the bath I know they are all there and I don't have to hunt for ages finding them. I'm then going to get into my cosy dressing gown. I get questions all the time about where it's from and it is from Boo Avenue one or two years ago maybe. And now it is time to have a little bit of a pamper for myself. So first of all I am going to start cleansing my skin. I couldn't recommend this cleanser enough and I feel really bad because I use it in almost every single routine videos but it is genuinely part of my morning and evening routine. 
So if you guys are interested in purchasing this, I do have a 70 set of code for you guys. It's crazy. So it makes it so much cheaper than what it is. And I use it every single day. It is battery operated, which I think is very handy because you can recharge batteries. And also it's just good because it's portable. You can take it away with you. It's very compact, the case and stuff. So yeah, it's so good. I'm then gonna move on to my Pure Clay Detox Mask. This is a mask from L'Oreal. As you can see, I use it a lot. I don't like to use masks all the time on my skin just because I do find them a bit harsh sometimes, but once every two weeks maybe, once every week, it just depends on my skin. I feel like in the winter I do use masks a lot more just because I feel like my skin needs the extra love. And then I'm gonna use my favorite Elemis spray. I use this every morning and every night without fail. It is honestly insane. I feel like this is what makes my skin have that extra glow to it. After my skincare is all done, I'm then just going to move on to moisturising my body. I'm using the amazing Soap & Glory moisturiser. I feel like Soap & Glory products just smell insane. You can't go wrong. So I always, at the moment especially, I'm moisturising because I'm trying to keep my tan and I don't want to peel. So I'm moisturising as much as I can because we all know when it gets a bit colder, your skin does dry out. So don't forget to moisturise your hands as well. So now I am all cosy in my dressing gown. I thought it's now time to treat myself to a little hot chocolate. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not the best at making hot chocolates. I feel like I need to Google a really good way to make it, but it was still yummy and I feel like I really deserve sweet treats sometimes. I've got such a sweet tooth, it's crazy. So after I've made it, I am bringing it into our bedroom. As you've just seen, Bradley was playing FIFA and as the new ones come out, he is obsessed. Is anyone else's boyfriend like that at the moment? So I thought, you know what, I'm just leaving him to it at the moment. He'll probably, probably not, get over it soon. So anyway, it's time for me and Lottie to have our time and it's also a good thing because it means I get to watch my own telly, <laughs> which makes me happy and I love reality TV. I know it's a bit corny sometimes, but I love it and it's just nice to have me and Lottie time. I am then just going to have my hot chocolate and I always edit at the moment before bed. I feel like I've got so much work to do, which is a good thing, but I do work silly hours. So I'm just going to finish editing and yeah, that's literally my evening routine. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you have. Come and say hi to me over on Instagram and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.